And they're away. Pretty good even break too. Pat Edry making his way over immediately, you'll notice, from the left of the picture on uh, Magic Gleam, coming right over towards the stand side to join Monster Jam. These being followed by Allborn. Vague shot racing wise of the others. Tracking the two leaders is Luna Mover with the sheepskin noseband. But it's Pat Edry on Magic Gleam, come right over from stall nine to the stand side to make the running, the champion jockey from Monster Gem. Vague shot on the far side, distant relative on the near side, with all born close, Luna Mover just in behind them, past the five, well past the five, and still Magic Gleam with Monster Gem trying to press him towards his outside, then Vague Shot just in behind them, distant relative travelling smoothly, so's Old Bourne they're coming down past the half mile mark and as they do so it's still Magic Gleam Magic Gleam in the lead, in the near, on the near side, making ground all the time, is distant relative. Allborn just in behind them. Monza Gem has dropped right out of it. They're coming down to the two pole now. Making good ground is Mirror Black towards the left of the picture, towards the outside. Allborn has taken it up. Mark of Distinction is moving well, just in behind the lead too. And it's distant relative who's just about taken it up from Mirror Black. Magic Gleam on the near side and here comes Mark of Distinction and Frankie Dettori to come and storm into the lead on the near side. Mark of Distinction taking it up now as they race towards the line is Mark of Distinction that's going to win it from Mirror Black at the line. Mark of Distinction the winner. Mirror Black is second. Third was distant relative and four Magic Gleam and tailed off last, dramatically tailed off last was Henry Cecil's representative, Steve Gawthon's ride. Monsters under orders and they're away. And on the near side, Green Line Express going on. And on the far side, Candy Glen, but now Shavian. Shavian takes it up from Green Line Express. Linamix is right up there with the pace in fourth. Just in behind him comes Call to Arms. And distant relative is one of the back markers with Croupier and being chased along there too at the moment. And Shavy and the leader past the sixth pole from Green Rail Express in second and Candy Glen four. Then comes Tyrol on the inside. Right up with him is Call to Arms. Then just in behind them come City Dancer and Linamix and then Market Distinction and Croupier. And then Distant Relative and Pat Edery. Last in the, of the field of the ten runners at the moment as Steve still blazing the trail on Shavian, who's got a three-length advantage now over Green Line Express. Then comes Candy Glen and then Tyrrell. Then comes Call to Arms and City Dancer. Then Market Distinction and Linamix who's been chased along by Freddie Head and making no progress at the moment. Then Distant Relative and Croupier is now the back marker swinging for home and Shavian has stretched him. He's got two and a half lengths over Green Line Express in second, then comes Tyrrell making ground on the inside in third, four on the outside is Candy Glen and then comes Call to Arms and behind them Distant Relative is now making ground with Mark of Distinction and Green Line Express comes to tackle Shavian, Green Line Express comes to tackle Shavian and take it up but here comes Distant Relative who's come from last to first with Mark of Distinction making strides with him Distant Relative on the near side, Mark of Distinction on the far side, Frankie Dottori on Mark of Distinction, Pat Henry on Distant Relative, they're racing head for head for And then Linamix and Candy Glen, and then the disappointing Tyrrell, and then City Dancer, and finally Call to Arms. And so the result of the 1990 Queen Elizabeth II Stakes, first number four, Mark of Distinction, 